guys, Crown Spider here. Today it's a review of stuff from Ultraman Rube. First, the DX Rube Gyro. Now this thing is the main transportation device we used by the Minato brothers, Katsumi and Isami. And first, this thing uses three AAA batteries you get from the spring loaded button right there. Just get like a pin or something, push it, slide, and you're done. You get three AAA batteries, turn this on, you do not get a pleasant noise. Easy. Oh, this is also going to be a triple three in one review for part one of two. I'm also going to be reading the root crystal holder and root crystal set three because that gives you the main four crystals for Ultraman Rosso and Ultraman Blue. Katsumi and Itami, respectively. So, crystal holder. Well, first, the root gyro comes with two root crystals, the main gift Ultraman Taro with the element of fire. And Ultraman Ginga with the element of water. Not space, but eh, I guess the full carnal element earth, fire, the, the wind, fire, water, ground, wind. They just need heart, then we perform Captain Planet. Or the Avatar, depending on which one you use. Yeah, so the crystal holder comes with the crystal for Ultraman Tiga, which is wind. And yeah, so one side, Ultraman Russell, the other side, Ultraman Blue, cast in a nice shade of black plastic with some nice Bandai Silver, again, amazing, metallic blue and metallic red, and special, and look at it, if you can, and look at it, little Ultraman symbol. So yeah, they were just held in by these two, these little spring loaded clips, and yeah, so, oh yeah, and then Rue Crystal Set 3. I specifically have set three because it comes with the crystal for Ultraman Victory, which element is ground. Also, two kaiju crystals. Um, I forget the names of these two. I'll probably say in the Rube Gyro. I know one of them is Holdemodus. I think it's. I believe it's this one. Uh, no, that's. Oh wait, shoot. That's that's Ultraman Hikari. He's more of a. He doesn't have a specific form for the main Ultraman. He's more of the one to use for the finishers. Which, if I had the Rude Slugger, which I don't have right now, I would totally put this in. Yeah, but then, there's, there we go, I think this one's, I believe this one is Hortobordos. I don't remember what this one is. We will find out soon enough. First, the Rude Gyro, these little black parts are actually spring-loaded, so you push this part in the middle. This, they sort of slide out. I'm going to have it like this. I'll do this, I'll, put, I'll have them pop up once for the, for the main transformation. Starting with Ultraman Rosso. Flame. Now, also, there are three prongs on the back of these crystals. Two horns, one, one, two curved outer horns, one single middle horn. The two outer horns are for Rosso, the middle horn is for Blue. So, starting with Rosso. Select. Criticize. Flick. Over. Then click in. Stand my noise. Atohi, grand no hole. Pull once, twice, three times. Lighter effect. Also, these I'm gonna let these go down. Wait for a bit. Then pull three times again. <laughs> Special attack. Again, beautiful lights. And then, so remove the crystal. Just take it out. Now, flip it out for Ultraman Blue. Also, the way it tells if it's Ultraman Rolls or Blue is just that one small tab. And you can't, no, you can't have all three of the prongs out at once and give it a new form. That would be cool, though. So, next, Ultraman Blue Flame. Red and Blue.
he actually has a different kind of kind of final attack. I don't know why that's second minute now. So yeah, that's Ultraman that's the Ultraman Tower Crystal. That's the noise you get when you take out the crystal. Next, Ultraman Ginga. Starting with blue this time. Select them. Pretty stuff. Insert. Can you stand by noise? Mato music. Come to me. One, two, three. Yeah. His attack. Aqua Sodium! So, then, Rosso. Oh, and I just realized I forgot to mention the speaker is right on the back. Now, attack. Splash ball. Now, remove the crystal. Using the crystal fuller. Then go to Tiga. So, first, we're going to start with Isami, this configuration, because it's weird, because Rosso has, on the Rosso side, it's, Ging, it's Victory and Taro, which both have horns. Blue side is Ginga and Tiga, which have the single. Point. I think it's kind of neat. So, select the I forgot what they say for the wind configurations and also the ground. So, Attack. Storm shooting. Pop back down. Now, Rosso. Screw this tissue. Rosso. Select crystal. Attack. Hurricane Bullet. And you can tell this the noise this thing makes is very loud. Remove the crystal. 
and then fold back into the crystal case. And finally, for this part of the review, well, other than the other crystal set, most of the crystal set, Victory. Ginga's partner, actually. Selecto, Crystal. Starting with Rosso. Plop this sucker in. Green orange. Attack. Ground explosion. Selecto, Cristo. Okay, I think my crystal might be a little broken because there it's it would something skip it something won't read. Okay. This thing just doesn't want to read, which I don't know why. Just, okay, I'm gonna have to do it. Attack. Oxbringer. I figure out what in the world is causing that malfunction. In the meantime, that's the main of the main four crystals. Then close it back up. Next. Ultraman, Hikari, maybe this is, I guess, secondary Ultraman, you could say. I mean, this thing doesn't really do much in terms of form, so we'll just put up it in, like, no, like so. Hopefully, if we can get it lined up. Yep, that's that's the Rosso side of I guess for the heck of it just let's just do the blue side for fun. I guess it is slightly different, but not by, mu not by much. Next, Kaiju Crystals. Kaiju Crystal number one. And it is... Let's see if I can get it in. Horobolus. Yep. Do it like I did. Portable crystal, then I attack. Oh. 
Second kaiju crystal, which is... Grevasa. Kaiju. And yeah, that is the end of part one. Tune in next time for part two, which will probably be uploaded immediately after, like right after this. For some, for the rest of my room collection. Oh, almost forgot. I want to mention the boxes for these th for these things. Now the um. Now the thing the. Package for the victory, the, the set that came with the victory crystal, I lost because it was sort of on the little, like, punch, it was like the whole punch cards, no wait, not punch cards, um, crap, I don't remember what, what they're called, like the card backs, I guess, you could, I don't remember what they're called, the, um, the, this, the, uh, crap, I, I can't think of anything, I don't know how to explain it, which, like, when you just see the action figures, they'll have the little hook, it's basically that. So, I gotta throw that one out, but the box for the Rube Crystal Holder. Nice. 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 The back. Top. Legal jargon. Then the Rube Gyro. Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Top. Legal jargon. The back. And yeah, that's part one. Next time, we're gonna go Ultimate.